Welcome to 501 Nightly, where we work smart but hard. In today's video, we're given this diagram of a circle, a square, and another circle, where we know the radius of the largest circle is 1 cm. With that, we're to determine the radius of this small circle. Pause the video here, give it a try, see what you can come up with. I'm gonna solve it this way. So, first off, we can see that that is a square so if that side is one centimeter then that side is also one centimeter then let's join that diagonal and label these vertices a b c and then we have by Pythagoras' theorem that the square of ab plus the square of bc is equal to the square of ac substituting our values we have one squared plus one squared is equal to ac squared so that will be 2, which means that AC is going to be the square root of 2. Next, let's focus on that tiny circle. That's going to be the radius R. And that's also going to be the radius R. And if we join them and label our vertices D and E, then again by Pythagoras' theorem, we'll have that the square of DE plus the square of EC is equal to the square of DC. Substituting our values, we have r squared plus r squared is equal to ac squared. That will give us 2r squared. So ac will be the square root of 2r squared. The square root of r squared is just r, and the square root of 2 will leave that in its exact form. So we get that ac is root 2r. Next, let's go ahead and join ac once again and label certain particular points like f. That is the radius of the big circle. And then G, that's the center of the small circle. So we have that GC is 2R, FG is R, and AF by definition is 1, since it is the radius of the large circle. So we have that AF plus FG plus GC is equal to the entire length AC. But we know that AF is 1, FG is R and GC is root 2R and overall AC is root 2. Solving for R, we can transpose the 1 and subtract it from root 2. Then on the left hand side we're left with R plus root 2R. We can factor out an R as 1 plus root 2. Then transposing that 1 plus root 2 we would divide by it and that is the answer in its exact form. Root 2 minus 1 over root 2 plus 1 or in its approximate value form 0.172 to 3 decimal places. Did you get it right? If so, comment below. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button, share with others and subscribe if you're new here.